Hi, I'm Susan Berkeley with the Inside VoiceOver video e-newsletter. And today we're going to talk about a question I get all the time, which is where do you find great scripts for your voiceover demos? Because it's really, really important. You know, the scripts make the demo. They really are everything. The script makes the spot. If you don't have good words to say, if you don't have a poignant, a funny, an interesting, a well-written script, it's like you're just not properly showcased. So it's very, very important to get great scripts for your demo. That being said, where do you get them? Now, there are copy libraries online, and the problem with those, and there's lots and lots of choices, is that they're pretty picked over. Remember, there's a lot of people out there that have done demos and want to do voiceover, and if you take scripts from those copy libraries, you risk having a cookie cutter demo, a, a demo that sounds like everybody else's. So it's much better to develop and find scripts. Uh, but do not write your own script, right? Because the people that write the scripts for real commercials are paid a lot of money, sometimes six and seven figures on big campaigns, or they'll get a percentage of what sells. So why not work with the best? So I say you want to use actual spots that ran on the air. Now the trick is you don't want to pick something that's very popular that everybody knows was a celebrity or a famous voice and wasn't you. But believe me, you won't have a problem. There are thousands and thousands of things to choose from. My favorite resource for scripts is something called iSpot TV. These are actual commercials that ran on the air. You can just go to that URL or just go to YouTube and you will have an infinite number of scripts to choose from and you can actually turn on the closed caption and you'll have the whole thing transcribed for you. Isn't that cool? Now, you might be wondering, is, is this copyright infringement? Am I allowed to take pieces of, of a script that actually ran on the air? And the answer is yes, you are. If you use a small portion, it's known as fair use. What's a small portion? I think, I don't know the exact number, but it's 10 seconds, 15 seconds. Believe me, it's a demo. Nobody is going to come after you. So. Choose, use a real script that was an actual commercial, but choose judiciously, don't choose something too popular, and take a tiny snippet. And then you've got everything you need. You can also change, by the way, pieces of that. You can change the client name, you can change him for her, you can change the types of holidays. Now here at Great Voice, when we do demos for our students, our coaches always help the student pick scripts. We never leave you alone with that very important thing. And we will only pick the scripts after we've worked with you for five sessions at least, coaching you, getting you ready to do your demo, having a whole conversation with you about which niche market you want to work with. So that'll make it easier for you as well. I'm Susan Berkeley, back next week with more Inside VoiceOver.